Clue 2, Electric Boogaloo. Done. Video over. <laughs> 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 Here with Clue Two Glazer, <laughs> Clue Two Champion back in the day. I was all the tournaments. This is Clue Two Murder in Disguise. Yeah, sequel to the VCR Clue game that we played way back when. Yeah. What is the sequel to Transformers? <laughs> when you said what? that this was the Clue video game, I. Oh. I lied. <laughs> I did it. <laughs> well, you know, just so we're clear, it's the, the sequel to the VCR game that we played, which I'm yes. sure they'll get when they read the title. This is the worldly one, I guess, because they've got like the Eiffel Tower, Ooh. And, like the Chinese house. See, this is a murder in disguise, much yeah. like robots in disguise. Mm -hmm. They're more than meets the eye. I already made that joke. No. So we, we don't remember how to play this, so we're going to have to get refreshed. Yeah. We'll see if I the replacement mm -hmm. for did it tells us. Yeah. Boo. That was a picture? My name oh. is Inspector Pride. Ooh. Interpol. I'm keeping my eyes on the following criminals. He's a regular Dex dog tech. I suggest you do the same. Excuse me. Whoa, what a jerk Mr. Green is. Somewhere okay. in the U.S. <laughs> a billiard room somewhere in the U.S. Moving off the guy that's been hanging around. They're on to you. Look, <laughs> Green, you got to help me get out of the country. He still got poison beside him. <laughs> Your picture's on page 27. We gotta get out of the country. Get out. Mm. <laughs> Hotel <laughs> room somewhere in the U.S. Wow. Is Mrs. White yeah. just the Do maid you everywhere? The uh -huh. Do you want me to turn down the bed? Why? Is it too loud? <laughs> oh. That's amusing. I like it. <laughs> Does she not recognize her? No, they don't know each other now. I mean, got <gasps> When will you be leaving us, man? On the very next flight. Mrs. Peacock's just always linked to her husband's murder, isn't she? Police believe they are closing in on the whereabouts of the notorious Mrs. White. Uh, maybe we can share a cab. Good idea. Everyone, wave your head as you talk. <laughs> so, okay, so everybody did it. I'm running that down. Yeah. Everybody we solved did it. it. Yeah. Everywhere. You know, this idea of going straight. <laughs> I'm afraid there is no brunette here. <laughs> no, 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 no. I said uh, brune... Hilda, yeah. Con games weren't good enough for you. Now it's time to go straight. I made a mistake. Shoot me. I'm sorry, what me? <laughs> <laughs> Bird did it. Calling it. Yeah. There's a newspaper in the bottom of this cage. <gasps> the birds pooped on it. Mustard, we must call off the mission. Scarlet, please. This is my first spy job in years. I am in charge. <laughs> Madam Rose! Oh, I'm checking out. Oh, she's like the seance lady, right? Oh, yeah, that was really annoying. Yeah. Jen! Uh, don't you want to leave a forwarding address? Ma'am, this is Monopoly money. <laughs> I don't know how these people forgot their experience in the mansion already. So th are they in a hotel? I think this is like Dark City, where mm. like everybody's memories are changed. Oh. Hello again. Now welcome to Parker Brothers VCR Clue Game. Oh, uh, broke the fourth wall. <laughs> the object of the game is to discover who are the murderers and victims, the room in which each murder took place, and which weapon was used. The detective fact sheet will help you keep track of what you learned. So, everybody, take one now. I didn't learn anything, though. I did it. <laughs> Let's ignore the section on the left that says players. That's my favorite part of the game, but we'll save that till later. Okay. It says here we have three murders. That's three victims, three different murderers, three rooms, and three weapons. <laughs> you must complete the first three lines of this accusation. Okay. And to do that, you need... What's your name again? <laughs> For this game, we'll use the blue clue cards only. Put all the other cards away. Put them away. 
I'll leave them where they are. Thank you. The clue card show facts number... Wait, quickly, you're going too quickly. fast. The initials at the right tell you whether a fact concerns a murderer, victim, weapon, or room. If you remember what you've just seen, you can start to solve the mystery right now. I sure can't. Grab a pencil, and we'll do it together. We'll do it together. The woman who opened the door committed murder with the candlestick. That makes Mrs. Peacock a murderer. And her weapon was the candlestick. Now mark all that down on your fact sheet. The weapon held by Monsieur Brunette was used to commit murder in the lounge. Well, Brunette held the candlestick. So that means the candlestick was used in the lounge. I can note that by connecting them. But if I know that Peacock used the candlestick, and the candlestick was used in the lounge, Mrs. Peacock killed someone in the lounge. I can enter all that right here in the accusation. Yep. Pause tape and mark this down. We all win. Yeah. The man who held up the papers died in the room with the birdcage. Yeah. Plum had the papers, so he's a victim. Damn you, Plum. Use that birdcage. I'll make a note till I recall. That's it. The lounge. Plum died in the lounge. <gasps> that makes Plum. him Peacock's victim. And we've Son solved one of the bitch. three murders in this game. Take a few minutes now to read the facts on your clue cards. See what you can learn about the other two murders. Don't worry if you can't remember everything. You can't remember anything. Play begins with the person on my left. What kind of information do you need most? Do you need a fact about a murderer, a victim, a weapon, or a room? Pick any other player and ask for the kind of fact you need. Instead of asking for a fact on your turn, you may replay the scene. Or pick a clue card from the deck. When you think you've solved the mystery, announce that you're ready to make an accusation. Use this special red filter to check the solution in the case book. I'm trying to remember all the names, honestly. Yeah, but I don't remember a bunch of these things. Like the man in trouble with the IRS. I don't remember. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'd kind of like this better if it was like a scenario where you saw a murder and you had to watch for actual clues. Yeah. Which I wish, you know, I had these before because I didn't pay attention to any of these facts they're giving me, so they're completely useless. Yeah, <laughs> well, I think that's what he was talking about, though. He said, don't worry if you don't remember it because you'll be able to see the scene again. Mm -hmm. So do I start? I don't know. I guess you're on the left. I'm, I'm on his left. Yeah. <laughs> Right. So confusing. So I can choose to replay a scene? So does that mean any one of the intro scenes? Well, there's only one scene in the intro. Yeah. The other ones have multiple scenes. Hey, Allison, do you have anything related to a room? Yes. The suspect who had to pack killed her victim in the room with the group portrait. Oh, that doesn't help me at all. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I, I want to replay the intro. So this is the only things that we have for the intro. We're just solving from the intro. I can. I think yeah. we can take a card. I'm gonna take a card. Yeah. Ed, do you have anything on weapons? Poison, and both weapons seen in the dining room were used for murder. Hmm. The man in trouble with the IRS died in the room where Inspector Pry showed his ID. Ed, do you have anything on murderers? Um, the suspect with a name tag and the suspect pictured on page 27 were not murderers or victims. Alright, I think I have them. How do we, how does that work? You yeah, try to solve it and we'll check with the uh, okay. decoder or text specs. So if I'm wrong, then you guys just keep going. Yeah, I guess. Okay. Then you die. <laughs> Then I die, I guess. Yeah. Okay. Allison. Usually, yeah. All right, I, I guess I'm gonna Clue see... Clue to kill Alice. <laughs> Killer Boogaloo. Yeah. Mrs. Peacock murdered Mr. Plum in the lounge with the candlestick, which was the first one. Mrs. Peach murdered Mr. Brunette in the billiard room with the knife. Madame Rose murdered Mrs. White in the hotel room with the poison. I was right. I win first round. Uh. Da, 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 da. So we're losing. <sighs> I am the Clue 2 champion! Worst. Clue 2 Glazer, why didn't you win? <laughs> I, I had one that gave me I forgot. Me all the... I'm terrible at this game. <laughs> <laughs> I was wrong. My major lead dried up on this. Megatron? <laughs> <laughs> well, I had one that gave me all the victims. That was a really good one. Nice. Nice. <laughs> Look up the correct solution. If you're wrong, you lose. 
but stick around in case someone wants to ask you a question or get a fact from you. And he asked the dead. <laughs> By using Megatron's spirit. <laughs> Damn you, Starscream. If no one can do this, then you must be the best detective after all. Shut up. Your suspect card is your secret personal identity. The others will try to learn who you are by interrogating you, asking you a yes or no question. Are you played by Christopher Lloyd in the movie? <laughs> Are you cheating? <gasps> dun, dun, yeah. Dun, dun, dun. Big fat cheater face. She ever wins anything. With six or more players, it's a good idea to team up. Facebook tells you how. Turn against your friends. <laughs> Become monsters. You've watched all five scenes and continued playing until you've gotten all the murderers. Oh, he just gave it to us. Yeah. Not to formerly yeah, accuse Inspector Pry. <laughs> <laughs> when last we saw our suspects, they'd all flown the coop. Paris. Flown the coop, huh? <laughs> well, here we are. And just where is here? Paris? What are you doing in Paris? Colonel Mustard, Miss Scarlet. Who? Uh, you must have us mixed up. If you're mixed up, that's your problem. What are you two doing in Paris? What are we doing in Paris? Is that where we are? Oh, that was Murray. He was my fifth. Arsenic. Cyanide. I love... Well, she's a murderer. <laughs> it's a bloody reunion. Hello. We remember each other now. <laughs> remember when we murdered each other? This is like Murderer's World Tour. <laughs> Inspector Pry, somehow he told us. And got here before we did. Oh, he's good. Inspector Pry's gotta be good. He's walking around with the answer book. You who everybody? How about a seance? Oh no. <laughs> Dear God, let's all kill ourselves right now. <laughs> it. Solved it. <laughs> I think they like kill each other, but they're like in purgatory, so they just keep coming back. <laughs> we kill each other again. That's what they get. They're in murder or hell. <laughs> oh, oh, no. He followed her to Paris to bring her her rope. That's the premise. Paris! Stop and play a round of interrogations. Then take one regular turn before viewing this scene. Allison, is your character named after a color? <laughs> Yes. Does that count? Would peacock count as a color? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sort of. They were kind of reaching at that point. All right. Oh, well, I guess we can ask. Like, did you do this thing in the in the video? Or yeah. Oh, if, something if the like person that. remembers. So, so it's yeah. Like, so it's about if you remember <laughs> what like, they why? did. Or is it like? Is it like guess who? It's like so. Is your guy Asian? Yeah, you could probably. Well, yeah. I guess yeah. Asian would really narrow it down. But... All right. Is your guy? A guy. No. All right, Ed, is your guy a guy? No. <gasps> Ed, does your girl have black hair? No. She marked that down. <laughs> Mark that down. <laughs> <laughs> no, man, it wasn't Megatron. <laughs> Still thinking or, it might have been. Or is your Red guy Harry. Megatron? <laughs> Is so your guy the leader of the Decepticons? <laughs> the people who first bought this game are probably yeah, still let's playing Let's cheat yeah. off their answers. <laughs> yeah, for I think. <laughs> they wrote, fuck this. <laughs> no. At least you're not forced to work everywhere you go. Why are you? Yeah. Maybe Mrs. White should think of changing her clothes. <laughs> yes. <Yeah. laughs> you're in a maid's outfit? All right, get to work. See, that's on the cover. Some like it hot. Clue edition. <laughs> it's just those two ugly women. Then here. Put this out for the rats. <laughs> Horses. <laughs> All right, Mrs. Peach. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that was so obvious. Phelan, mm. were you dressed as a lady in one of those scenes? As a lady? Yeah. Yes? Phelan, does your character have a mustache? No. Ed, does your character have gray hair? Let me see. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I mean, no, she just dyed it. <laughs> I mean, no, she never had it. <laughs> Don't, you know, look up the answers so that you can win the game quickly. <laughs> and save oh, us all this agony. <laughs> I want to do this on my own! 
Please, Scarlet. I, I wouldn't let you down. I'm a good spy. I, I really am. Yeah. <laughs> really? Where is the manager? He went out to lunch. You are the most irritating woman. Everything's not funny now. <laughs> gonna make him a murderer again. He called me Mr. Green. <gasps> Why, it is Mr. Green. Why, you dressed up like that? A shock to no one. <laughs> oh. How can I be of help? Colonel Mustard is the only one who's allowed to have a British accent. <laughs> <laughs> but Miss Scarlet, I'm a very good spy. I really am. <laughs> Mustache. Safari. <laughs> Uh, the room's full of people. I have to kill them. <laughs> uh, listen. Um, <laughs> does your character have a southern accent? Yes. I had to remember if she did or not. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> Is your character wearing a hat, Ed? A hat, Ed? I don't yes. know what that looks like. <laughs> yes. No, who both. It doesn't matter. Yeah, well, don't bother it, then. Then, yeah, we'll just skip it. Allison, yes. tell me about a murderer. A murderer? Preferably you. <laughs> <laughs> dun, dun, dun. One man murdered the woman he offered to take to the ladies' room in scene two. Phelan, you got anything about rooms? Rooms? Murder occurred in the room where Mr. Green was cheerful, and also the room where he got angry. That's for scene four. <laughs> <laughs> what room was that? <laughs> oh, what a good spy. <laughs> I'm a very good spy. I love sitting close in a plant. <laughs> <gasps> referring to that chiffon number? There was a bomb in there! That was the chiffon, chiffon number is the bomb. Ah, damn it. Ah. <laughs> you already did my job. Because <laughs> I'm the bomb. No. <laughs> Good spy. <laughs> He's the bomb. <laughs> Tom, I love you. <laughs> I put a lot of years into stealing that money. The mob knows I stole that money. Who stole my money? Who stole my son of money? He had no comment on the bomb. Maniac? I become the thing I hear, of course. I become the thing I hear the most. <laughs> I did it. Ed, what do you know about uh, victims? Not much, you. Oh, um, <laughs> absolutely nothing. You don't have any victim cards? I have cards? nothing else, which means I believe you're allowed to ask someone else. The suspect with a gun in her suitcase died where she un unpacked it, C4. You remember that by now. <laughs> Spin the poison. It's a fun game. Any chance seen a stray bomb lying about? A bum? A bum? Do you want to drink of my poison? I'm making discreet inquiries. I heard. Uh, no one's seen the bomb. <laughs> Sergeant Gray is out there frothing at the mouth. Someone must have reminded him that he's a homicidal maniac. He <laughs> <laughs> must have reminded him. <laughs> he's reset the timer. It's going to go off any minute. That's news to me. With uh, the nearest exit <laughs> time. Oh, Why is everything locked? That was their first instinct to try and get out the window. Oh, uh, because they're idiots. Not to worry, I found the key ring. Oh, 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 again. <laughs> and he's got their boom. Let's run on our knees out of here. <laughs> Pretty sure Sergeant Gray's a murderer. I don't know. He's a mad dog. I don't killer. care what these cards do. <laughs> so, Ed, you got anything on murderers? What's it worth to you? The game? <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. The man who wouldn't tell his business and the suspect who asked him were both murderers. What you got on weapons? The weapon Miss Scarlet pulled in the hall and the weapon Sergeant Gray gave to Professor Plum were used for murder in scene three. 
Okay, I'm going to attempt to solve. Fail with first of all accusations. You are Professor Plum. You are no. what? No. Oh, you're not. Wait, but I thought. Okay. <laughs> so you're That's the wrong. in ladies' clothes. <laughs> oh, <laughs> son of a bitch! Yeah, but I just asked if I was in ladies' clothes. Yeah, you said you did, you were, didn't you? Yeah, yeah, and that I didn't have a mustache. Yeah. It still leaves all the women. Right. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I totally botched it. Oh. You're clever. very clever. 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 Bitch. And we could have been, I could have been like, I would have figured it out by now if I had actually, like, hmm. You can stay in the game, though, because... Yeah. You didn't say anything else? Yeah. Is your character Asian? No. Alright, so... Ed, do you have anything about the weapons? The weapon Mrs. Peacock took into the billiard room, and the weapon on the pool table were not murder weapons. <laughs> oh my stupid cards. <laughs> Is your character female? Mm-hmm. Does your character have gray hair? Mm-hmm. Stupid picture. <laughs> <laughs> stupid madam wrote. Are you done with this? Yes, I'm done with this. Accusation. <laughs> J'accuse. <laughs> you are... Mrs. Peacock. No. God damn it. <laughs> really? No. <sighs> Alright, now I know who it is, but yeah. <laughs> There's only like one other yeah. could be it. Nope, I know who it is. <laughs> yeah, but I thought that's who you were. Nope. Well, maybe, but nope. <laughs> or am I? Holy shit balls, we suck at this. I'm amazing at this, if you haven't noticed. <laughs> Look at how much I'm winning. <laughs> All right, so I have not you gotten probably a got it wrong. once you get past that. Fortunately, people watching have absolutely no idea how bad we are at this because they can't yeah. see what we can see. Man, I'm like, doing man. so good. Look at all the cards yeah. that, that needs I'm doing well. Ed's made some really educated guesses about <laughs> what we're failing this. I can understand how he might have gotten it wrong. Now we're back to interrogation. Jacques. <laughs> <laughs> I have gathered you all into the accusing parlor to say that failing is. Mrs. White. Yes. Thank God. <laughs> I mean, I knew it the whole time. <laughs> and Allison, you are Miss Peach. Oh no, no, I am. <laughs> and I and uh, I'm going to I'm going to say that Mr. Green murdered Mrs. Peach in the dining room with a gun, and Miss Scarlet murdered Madame Rose in the hotel room with the rope. And I'm going to find out Dun. if that's true. I don't know how to find out if that's true, but I'm I'm going to do it. Where's the text? Back? There it is. Alright, so this is game two of the blue chapter. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Heck yeah! <laughs> I win! Oh. Ed wins! All oh, that stupid Mrs. White killed you up. Clue to Glazer wins again. <laughs> Who were you in the end? You were Peacock? Oh, oh Madam Rose. I thought you said you had gray hair though. I do. It's gray hair. She doesn't have gray hair. It looks gray. No, it's not. It's, it's not, not at all. Gray. That's why I thought. <laughs> I lied! <laughs> I asked if you had a hat and you yeah, said yes. I had peacock oh, wait. down for you too. I asked if you had a hat and you said yes, oh, and that's why I had I thought light. it was the wrong person. <laughs> I ruined it. I could have won. I could have been the champion. Ed wins by lying. <laughs> Did you have all the other stuff there? Uh, well, no, I had the weapons okay, wrong. So you lost. wouldn't have won. <laughs> Ed wins! Just, yeah, we just, can just watch this. I have amnesia she had, she had like, neither, <laughs> like Sergeant neither. Gray. So check it. Uh, I was like, okay, I remember now that I am Madame Rose, right? Uh -huh. And so I'm like, okay, now I'm, I'm looking and you're like, do you, do you have a hat or do you have gray hair? I'm like, I'm not right. going to look at this, I'm just going to pick this up. Yeah. I'm like, uh, Madame Rose. Oh, oh, and then you... Yeah, yeah I, see. I, was, I was looking right into there. So I'm yeah. kind of an idiot, but not... I'm 90% idiot. <laughs> Somehow our friends managed to survive Paris. So, this is Tangiers, huh? That's what it says. <laughs> Not the best kept hotel. Well, anything beats that double. Oh, well, we just added more plants to the last one. <laughs> Whoa, it's totally different. <laughs> and why are you explaining it like this? For the audience. Oh. For the audience. Oh, oh. The murderer talked to the audience. Oh. I keep trying to do a cat's cradle and it gets all out of... Yeah. <laughs> Good job with the battering ram! <laughs> and as your travel agent, I Shut guarantee... Up. There's five murderers in, like, game six of these. Uh, oh my god. <laughs> 
just like plan for a week to play that one. Yeah. It's probably why these don't show up that often. People just just strike them in anger. That's why they're so expensive because they're so good. I don't remember who looked at the stupid painting for two seconds in scene three. See, my lead suspect was Rod in the. <laughs> you were close. I, yeah. that. I thought Optimus for a second, but I was like, why would he kill himself a lot of this? <laughs> well, the Megatron thing, you were slightly hesitant, like Megatron? Question yeah. mark, question mark, question but mark. Rodimus. Rodimus yeah, yeah, you were good. You were you're like, oh, Rodimus yeah. Prime, Rodimus. exclamation point. Yeah. Using like a lint roller on him? Mm. The murderer used the lint roller. <laughs> she killed the lint. <laughs> oh. Oh, there's that gray-haired lady over there <laughs> with the hat. Yes. I guess she has a turban. She is, this yeah, she's See? wearing something there. Not in the picture. <laughs> so? Let's not guess who rules. You, ha you asked if... <laughs> so what? So she wore a hat one time. So she wore she wore the hat. Yeah. Oh yeah. And she's... later in life, she has gray hair. <laughs> done and done. I'm completely honest. I died playing Clue too. <laughs> I thought someone else was Mrs. White. <laughs> Man, it sure would be great if suspects uh, told the truth all the time. <laughs> yeah, you'll never be a real detective. <laughs> I've watched enough Baywatch nights. I think I know how to solve crimes, okay? <laughs> and Ros if Rizzoli and Isles taught me anything, it's I can zoom in and enhance anything. <laughs> including cell phones. <laughs> So you should have been zoom able to in. zoom in on my card, yeah. flip it over digitally. Yeah. Yeah. X-ray vision. Yeah. Enhanced. Like, way it's way overexposed <laughs> since it's in the sunlight and this was taken inside. Just take that away. <laughs> oh, can you can you press the make footage good button? Yeah. <laughs> You lick the floor first. <laughs> the perfect crime. <laughs> you won't get away with this. I'm an Interpol. No, no. it's an Interpol. <laughs> you won't get away with this. I got the buck on all you guys. Tomaine poisoning. What, what is, is this? Is this? Now she doesn't wear a hat. <laughs> She's got headgear on. Everyone, okay, whoever doesn't have headgear in this scene did it. <laughs> <laughs> the person who was not in the pool hall scene. I wish they'd kill him already. Have to get him out of here before all these others come too. And what are you clowns up to? Dag it! Oh, no! It's not easy traveling without money, but our ten suspects have found a way. How did we wind up in Rangoon? Well, we had to get out of Tangiers. We were murdered in Tangiers, so we're like, we should get out of here. <laughs> well, Madame Rose certainly didn't do it. You broke into an old hotel. You broke into an old hotel that looked a lot like every hotel we've ever been in. <laughs> it's a little, little different, and we threw some things in different places. Yeah. Hey, Debbie, it's your agent. I got you that big break you're looking for. Clue the VCR game. <laughs> Dude, I would so be in one of these. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta make your own. Yeah. Make sure you don't make something like this where it's just like, pick out inane details. <laughs> yeah. Because what's happening here is not, does not correlate to what happened in the murders that we're investigating. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because otherwise some of these people would be dead. Mm -hmm. I mean, otherwise you could really just say like, uh, all right, you're playing Clue. Uh, so in The Matrix, uh, the color of his sunglasses in the second scene uh, as he's walking by the store is the color of the last name of the killer. <laughs> right. Mr. Black. If it was The Matrix, it would probably be. All right, so Mr. Green killed Mr. Green yeah. in the green with the green. And killed Mr. Anderson. <laughs> Some of the covers of the old Clue games would be like, everyone's kind of in the room together and it shows her like behind them all with a candlestick. <laughs> like, oh, shit. <laughs> She's the red herring, you know? Yeah. That's you don't yeah. know what the She's office. just going... <laughs> 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 well, no one behaves like normal people, apparently, in this world. Well, no, now we know how it actually goes down. Yeah. They're just a fun, ragtag bunch of murderers who travel the world together. <laughs> who is that with the headgear? Is it Peacock? Peacock, yeah. yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, 
The murderer I was wearing ten. a castle on her head. <laughs> Did she kill uh, someone with her headgear? <laughs> Just <laughs> like a bull. <bolt. laughs> yeah. Hey! Yeah, I don't know about you, but I'm famished, huh? Yeah? Alright, let me hold this for you, huh? Oh. Eleven boxes of fortune cookies. Uh, have a good time? The microfilm is on one of these fortunes. Start looking. Oh, I really yeah. gorged myself. Why did they have to eat the cookies? They didn't think they could just break them, right? No, you're not allowed to do it that way. Otherwise, the That's fortune is cheating. cursed. It's yeah. against cookie law. <laughs> <laughs> what? Stop goofing off. This is a serious game. We're trying to solve a murder here. I did it. Oh, we knew it was crying the whole time. Oh. Ash, solve the mystery. I don't care. <laughs> We'd all be a lot better off if we stopped trying to swindle each other and just went legit. Oh, they choose friendship. Let's, let's go legit. We'll be too legit to quit. We'll become professional assassins. Until clue three. <laughs> Cancel this. <laughs> you gotta try it. Cancel this. <laughs> wow. You guys gotta try this. Cancel. Clint Howard <laughs> ruined Clue 3. <laughs> oh my gosh, Clue 3 with Clint Howard, how amazing would that be? It's Inspector Prime! How did he ever find us? I'm just posting up pictures all over the world, I guess. <laughs> How'd he get our promo shots? <laughs> so they're all guilty. Of greed. <laughs> Robert Lovejoy. Mm -hmm. Film to tape transfer. Yeah. This is on film? Yeah. That is a sad looking film. <laughs> oh. Like it's just like an old film. VHS tape. Come on. Ah, uh, it does not look like film. It looks like shit. So, what do you guys think? Um. <gasps> ah! <laughs> I mean, I got a kick out of the. Uh, the segments and stuff. I've never been very good at the logic puzzle type games, the ones where it's like Jeff sits to the right of Alice and Joe doesn't like hamburgers. But uh, so so it's um, so those are always tricky for me to keep everything straight. But as yeah. far as entertainment goes, it's a cute kind of clue related thing. But I'll take the movie over uh, the VHS game. The movie is better. Time, yeah. Yeah. Well, I mean, they're kind of fun for how doofy the tapes are. Yeah. yeah. Well, the first but one yeah, was the um, doofiest, really. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's not worth the price you can find on eBay for Clue 2. Yeah, no, it's pretty dumb on eBay. It's something like 50 bucks or something. Whoa. Yeah, that's what I've seen them for before. Yeah. yeah. No thanks. But this was at um, the thrift store for two bucks. No, one dollar. She's lying. One do whatever. With one to two dollars. a sale that day, which made it all slightly less than a dollar. This is his t-shirt. <laughs> no, there goes dog. everything. No. Oh. Whatever, I don't even know your name, but dog from Food Fight. Dex Dog Detective, of Duh. course. Dog Detective. Dog Detective. Yes, Dex Dog Detective. Yes. Cinnamon Sleuth. So, uh, that's his cereal. Cinnamon Sleuth cereal. <laughs> I have to leave. <laughs> <laughs> Too many puns for Ed. <laughs> I'm not sure those kind of... Puns. <laughs> <laughs>